Hello everybody, my name is Alavar and welcome to Play Smash or Pass and we'll reveal who your celebrity wife should be. Now, uh, someone recommended me something like this a while, a while ago, but I, I didn't I didn't get around to doing it, but I thought this could be quite fun, this could be good banter. Um, I'm intrigued to know who my celebrity wife will be. Um, I hope it's someone decent. Um, so we're going to play this or do this quiz and uh, see who we get, but it, I'm quite excited. I think this, this this would be hilarious. So what we got then? While many of us will deny it, we all dream of becoming famous from time to time. Well, I sure do. Sure, getting followed by the paparazzi isn't ideal. I would, yeah, but there are many other perks to being famous. Take dating insanely hot woman as the example. <laughs> If you've given some thought of being famous, the thought of who your celebrity wife would be may have crossed your mind. If this is the case, you'll be happy to know that we are rooting for you. So much so that we've created this quiz to reunite you with your Hollywood babe. This is fucking brilliant. This is brilliant. Nowadays, dating is hard for everybody, and this is partially due to how many dating options people have. While having options is nice and all, it's safe to say that there are some people who are simply out of your league. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty much probably all the women on here. Um, these people are usually mixed with the popular crowd, aka the celebrities. While there are everyday well, there are some everyday men who have managed to snag themselves super gorgeous celebrity, this seldom happens. Are you tired of being stuck inside your uh, dating pool? Yeah, yeah, I am, yeah. If so, we're here to lend you a helping hand. In just a few minutes, you're about to find out who your celebrity wife would have been if you were a Hollywood man yourself. Wow. Let's go then. How intriguing. Diana Agron. Okay, I think I've seen her before. If you don't know who Diana Agron is, it's probably because you've never watched the TV show Glee. I think I watched like a couple of episodes, but I was never, yeah, I never got hooked on it. Well, you didn't miss out on much. You did miss out on seeing the gorgeous Diana Agron dance and sing about. So, smash or pass. I actually think Diana Agron's quite hot. Um, so, yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to smash that. Leah Michelle. Both Diana Agron and Leah Michelle got their big breaks on the TV show Glee. However, they hadn't done much since then. There are some who do not find Leah Michelle attractive, but they are clearly blind. So, yeah, yeah, I'd, I'd pass on her. She, she's not, I don't know, she ain't really quite my cup of tea. Halle Berry. If there is one beauty you can withstand the hands of time, it, that is so true. Halle Berry just, I don't even know how old she is now, but she's still extremely hot. Uh, it's Halle Berry, yes. This gorgeous woman has proven... On more than one account, that she had more than just a pretty face. Yeah, 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 I, yeah fucking hell, yeah. I'd smash Ali Bear every day of the week. Hannah Davis. Do you like your sandwiches like you like your supermodels? It's, it's, so, it's safe to call you a manly man. If you keep up with the babes uh, of the cover of Sports Illustrated, I don't because I think that's an American thing. Surely you know that the beauty is Hannah Davis. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not that keen. Kat Dennings. If there's one actress who is the queen of sarcasm, it's Kat Dennings. This sultry firecracker isn't one to be messed with, but definitely one to cast in your movies. Do you think that Dennings has to take what it takes to be a celebrity? Nah. I'm not. Yeah, nah. Emily Blunt, 100%. Already, yeah. Already, already, yes. I, I find Emily, I don't know. There's something about Emily Blunt I find really attractive. This may come as a shock to you, but did you know that Emily Blunt is married to the other actor who plays Jim in The Office? I didn't know that. If you didn't know, don't worry, you might have what it takes to steal her away from him. Yeah, there's something about Emily Blunt. Demi Lovato. Demi Lovato's come a long way uh, from where she used to be and nobody's complaining. While she might have started off singing poppy tunes, the diva quickly became one of the most popular artists in the world. Um, Demi, Demi, Demi. Smash or pass, love. I feel like these are big, big choices. I can't just, I can't just pick any old willy-nilly answer. But you know, I, I, I'm gonna pass. I'm gonna pass on Demi. I, I might come to regret that a bit later on, but no, I, I think I'm gonna pass on Demi for now. Who's this? A few years ago, model Charlotte McKinney was all the rage, but today some people have forgotten all about her. We're here to remind you of her existence, so you're welcome. Would you be happy if Charlotte McKinney was your celebrity wife? I don't even know her. I, I don't... Is she just a model? Um... No, you know, like, I think I'd pass. I think I'd pass on her. 
she's attractive, but it's like I said, big commitments, boys. I got uh, these are big questions. Uh, Natalie, Natalie, Emmanuel, Natalie. I'm just gonna say Natalie. Are you a fan of the hit series Game of Thrones? I am. Well, yes, when it was around. If so, you probably have the hots for the actress who plays Miss Sunday. Well, here she is. Her name is. Yeah, okay, yeah, I already know that. Yeah, I would, yeah. Yeah, I'd smash her. I don't like it when she has the nose ring, though. I'm not really a big fan of piercings. But, like that, and like she is in Game of Thrones. Yeah, absolutely. Angelina Jolie. For as long as most of us can remember, actress Angelina Jolie has been one of the hottest celebrities in Hollywood. Her recent divorce to actor Brad Pitt means that she's up for craps. So, would you smash her pass? Uh, I've never really been a fan of Angelina Jolie myself. Um, I don't know about you guys, but n not for me. She's just never really done it for me. Rose Byrne. Brian Byrne. Yeah. Uh, if you're a fan of actress Rose Byrne, I'm gonna, yeah, it's safe to say that you enjoy a good laugh as much as you do a beautiful woman. Do you think that Rose Byrne would make a good celebrity? Well, yeah, I think she would. Yeah, I would I'd smash yeah. I think she's quite hot. I know she's in like Insidious and all that other stuff. She's probably in other stuff. Probably more relevant than that, but it's only thing I can think of right now. I think it's because I watched it the other day. Cause I was, yeah, 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 I would smash her. Uh, <laughs> okay, Serena Williams. She'd probably break me in half, to be fair. There are some people who say that athlete Serena Williams isn't hot, but many would beg to differ. If there's one thing we can all agree on, however, is that the superstar comes to life when she puts a dress on. Yeah, she's a bit... She... she I... Yeah, she's a bit too... She's fucking enormous compared to me. I'd feel a little bit dis demasculated. Like, she'd destroy me. Uh, she'd smash her past me, I think. If you know, I, I would just be an acceptor, so to speak. Anna Kendrick. Okay, so, when it comes to actress Anna Kendrick, there are some people who think that her looks are debatable. Okay. However, we're here to tell you that this little lady has definitely dropped dead gorgeous, so would you smash or pass on Anna Kendrick? Um, there's something about her I like. There's something about Anna Kendrick I like. She's not, I mean, she isn't the be all end all, no. But I think her personality is pretty cool. And it's a bit like in Pitch Perfect and stuff, she's quite hot. Hmm. Yeah, you know what? I, I think I would. Yeah, I think I would. Some of you are probably thinking, what the fuck are these choices? Because there's probably some people you would and that I, you know. But uh, hey, this is my Smash or pass, pass quiz. You could do your own if you don't like my choices. <laughs> I'm joking. Iggy uh, Azalea. Yeah, no, I'm already passed on that. I don't. I'll read the thing out, but I don't find her attractive at all. Do you think that singer Iggy Azalea has got what it takes to be a celebrity wife? No, definitely not. If you don't, you're probably thinking of passing her right about now. Yeah, yeah. Do you have the hots for Iggy Azalea? No, 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 I don't. No. No. Uh, if there's one actress that nearly every single boy has had a crush on, it's Kaylee Kuko. Yeah, from Big Bang Theory, million percent. This blonde haired vixen is definitely a force to be reckoned with. Regardless, we wish you two the best. So, yeah, yeah. 100%. Like, in the Big Bang Theory, I remember watching that back in the day. And, like, there's this one episode where she, like, reveals she's in this black dress, and. Yeah. She fuck, she's hot. Although, she has to have long hair. Like, when she has the short hair in the later on seasons, I don't like it. I don't like it at all. So, I'm gonna say smash on the fact she has long hair, like, in the picture here. But if she's short hair, nah. Yeah, nah. Definitely not. Uh, there are two types of men in this world. Those who think Khloe Kardashian is hot, I don't. And those who think she's the absolute worst. Yeah, like, look at that face. Nah. We're here to find out which type of guy you are. So smash or pass. Yeah, d pass. All day of the week. Definitely not. Definitely not. Ashley Benson. Are you a fan of the show Pretty Little Liars? I've never actually watched it. I've never actually watched it. Um... But she looks quite hot in that picture. If so, you're probably aware of the beauty that is Ashley Benson. If you don't like the show, however, at least you can appreciate its cast members. So, Smash or Pass. Um, yeah, she looks... 
Yeah, yeah, she looks pretty hot to me, to be honest. Rita Aura. If you don't know who Rita Aura is by now, it's safe to say you live in a basement and don't have access to the internet or the outside world. Rita Aura is a gorgeous singer, model, and fashion designer. See? Like, she is, she is hot. Rita Aura is attractive. And she's got great set of assets um yeah I, yeah I, yeah I have to say yeah I have to Ellie Golden I already know what I'm putting here uh, there are some celebrities that are just beautiful they're so beautiful it's impossible to know about their existence okay Ellie Golden is one of those celebrities and to top it all off she has the voice of an angel so smart nah I, I don't find her attractive uh, Miley Cyrus for over a decade Singer and actress Miley Cyrus has chosen to entertain us with her existence. Yes, she's had a wild ride. While some people do not care for her music, it's safe to say we can all appreciate her beauty. So smash or pass. Nah, sorry Miley, if, not for me. Not for me, she's... Yeah, nah, not for me. I don't know who this is. Uh, if you don't know who Nadia Ford is, don't beat yourself up about it because she isn't that popular in the United States or Canada yet. Well, I'm from England, fella. And... I still don't know who she is. As a matter of fact, this babe is, babe is an Irish singer and fashion model. Okay, so she's uh, yeah. Um, nah. Priyanka Chopra. Is this the lady from Baywatch? Yes, yes, I just saw it. Yes, it is. Okay. It's not every day that you're introduced to a beautiful lady like Priyanka Chopra. I hope I'm saying that right. But today is the day. This gorgeous actress got her big break when she was cast in last year's Baywatch movie. So, Smash Pass Wow. Baywatch was a few years ago now, I think. But, um... She is hot. She is attractive. And she and again in Baywatch it Baywatch it looked like she did have some great assets. But no uh, These have got to be serious big they're big big decisions because I don't know who I'm gonna get. And any little doubt in my mind I have, I, I just have to I'm gonna have to go pass. Sorry. Sorry Priyanka. You, you, you're fit, but I just Nah. Penelope Cruz fucking out. She is one back in the day. If there is one actress who always brings heat to the table, it's Penelope Cruz. This woman has often been the object of desire in a movie, and it's easy to see why. So would you smash or pass? Yeah, nah. She's hot again. again. But I don't just want to keep... I mean, to be fair, all of them, bar Khloe Kardashian, probably, I'd probably smash. But... Like, when I really, really, really think about it, if it was, if I, you know, because I've got the choice on here, like, and I want to see who the actual celebrity wife would be, I, I, I've got I've got picked properly. So, sorry, Penelope. Britney Spears. See, back in the day, she was fucking phenomenal. And then she just went a bit... Yeah. Britney Spears. At one point in time, singer Britney Spears was the most desirable woman in the world. Yeah, she probably was. However, her status or status has dropped in the last decade or so. Nevertheless, she is still a beautiful and sought after celebrity. So smash pass. See, are we doing are we doing like the now Britney Spears or back in the day Britney Spears? Because back in the day Britney Spears, I would be smashing in a heartbeat. But now, probably not so much. So I'm gonna pass, ladies and gents. I'm gonna pass. Amelia Clark, old Daenerys Targaryen. If there's one woman who can drive the entirety of the male race at bonkers, it's Amelia Clark. This drop dead gorgeous woman got her big break by starring in the hit TV series Game of Thrones, so smash a pass. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Absolutely smash. Million percent. Over and over and over and over again. Because one, she looks fit with brown hair, she looks fit with blonde hair. Two, I've seen her on talk shows and interviews and she looks hilarious, she looks funny, she looks fun, she looks decent. Like she she that's a good wife. That's a whoever ends up with her, you got a good wife there. hundred percent. Margaret, yeah. Margaret is so fit. So so fit. I I I don't even have to read the bio. She already gets the smash button. Because Margot Robbie is phenomenal. 
And when she's dressed up as Harley Quinn. You know what I mean, boys. And girls, maybe. It's safe to say that if you don't know who Margot Robbie is by now, you don't really know anything. Okay. Should this be the case, allow us to broaden your mind by introducing you to her. So, yeah, yeah. 100%. Margot Robbie is... Margot Robbie is in my top two of most sought-out women. Uh, my top two women in the world are Margot Robbie and... But my number one is probably Alexa Bliss from WWE. Alexa Bliss is just my, like, my dream. But we can all dream, eh, boys? Ariana Grande. Oh, she, she, her voice does do my head in. But let's let's read the thing. If you can, if you think that good things come in small packages, you're probably a fan of Ariana Grande. While she may be small, this talented lady has a very powerful voice. So would you smash or pass on Ariana Grande? She's fit. But I, thought, I, I don't know. And to be fair, like. She, she does wow with herself and she's got a good voice and stuff, but I just find it like a little bit irritating. But <laughs> um, I mean in that picture she looks pretty fit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I would. Michelle Keegan, fuck me, she is one back in the day. While it is true that the majority of men do not care for soap operas, some of them might be worth the watch. Take Coronation Street for example, this popular show stars the gorgeous actress Michelle Keegan. Smash Bros. Yeah, yeah I would. Like... She's just... It, I probably seemed like I clicked that quite fast, and while I did... It, like I've known about her for ages and it's always been a bit like would I wouldn't I but yeah yeah I would I wouldn't want her as a wife probably not oh, fuck, what am I talking about I'm not thinking of anything better like that am I but anyway like yeah I, I would though but I don't want it to seem like I jumped to that as quickly as I actually did you know I don't know why I'm making such a big deal out of this Daisy Ridley oh Ray is it if you're a fan of the new Star Wars movie, you might have developed a tiny crush on actress Daisy Ridley. This beautiful brunette is definitely worth your time, wouldn't you agree? So would you smash or pass on Daisy Ridley? Um, Like, she's attractive. It's like, Daisy Ridley is attractive. But like, I like her as Rey. But when I see her in like her, like, like the dresses with like the, like the lipstick, like the real bright red lipstick and like the weight, like that sort of hairstyle. It just that just that doesn't do it for me. I'm not really into that sort of thing. So I'm gonna pass on you, Daisy Ridley. Sorry, sorry. I don't know who this is. Corinne Olympios. Do you get annoyed when an Instagram model calls herself a professional model? If so, you might not like not like take a liking to Corinne Olympios. While her career path may be dubious, you cannot deny that a woman is drop dead gorgeous. I don't know who she is. She looks a little bit like Hayden Panettiere, maybe. Does she? I don't know. But nah, I'm not interested in you. Ariana Celeste. I don't know who this is either. You might or might not know who Ariane Celeste is. I'm, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Uh, but, you do, but you don't need to know who she is to appreciate her beauty. This pretty lady is a ring girl on the UFF. Okay. And she also models professionally Smash Bros. Nah. Nah. Zandaya. Oh, this is, that's a toughy one. That's a toughy one. A couple of years ago, actress and model Zendaya was just another one of those teenagers on the Disney Channel. Today, I don't know what I'm talking about. Today, however, she is much more than that. This young woman is definitely on her path to greatness. See, I liked her in The Greatest Showman. I liked her hair and stuff in that. I did like her in Great Show. Yeah, 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 I would, yeah. Yeah, I would. Just, just the Great Showman alone, I, I just would. And she's, a, she's a bit, but she's quite a natural beauty, isn't she? To be fair. Yeah, I would. Carrie Underwood. She sounds familiar. If you listen to Carrie Underwood's music, oh, she's a singer. I thought she was an actress. You're probably going to think that she's a nutcase. Okay. However, you're probably right. As anyone who sings about slashing her ex's tires is local. Regardless of this, 
would you smash up pass? Um, I don't really know much about her. She looks okay. She looks nice in the picture. She got nice teeth. Um, but I'm gonna pass only because I don't really know too much about her. Slashing the exercise is a bit weird. Uh, despite her being quite attractive, I'm gonna pass on her. I don't know who this is either. Emily Sears. Uh, while it's true that we promised to reunite you with your celebrity wife, we don't see it as misleading to put a few Instagram models in our list. Yeah, but that's that's great and all, but in I don't know who they are. Uh, if you know who Emily Sears is, it's probably because you follow on it. Right? No, I don't, so I'm passing. And I'm not, you know, I'm not really a fan. Uh, Christina Million. I don't really know who this is either. Do you remember who Christian Christina Million is? If so, it's safe to assume you're older than 21 years old. Well, I am. I am older than that, and I still don't know who she is. This little lady definitely calls the show back in a day. Do you still think she's still got it? Um, no. Okay. This is it. So we are about to see my result. Do you know I'm actually a little bit nervous. I'm a little bit nervous. This is a massive deal. Even though it means fuck all, this is a massive deal. Are we ready? Are we ready? Here's my result. Olivia Wilde. All right. Okay. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna share this or tweet this with my friends. That's for sure. Olivia Wilde, I am, I'm happy with that. Olivia Wilde's fucking hot. Really hot. There we go. I, I, I'm, I don't know why I'm so pleased. Because it's not like this is real. Because if this was real, then... Happy days. Olivia Wilde, if you ever see this video, and you want me to be your uh, celebrity husband, by all means. I, I would love to. Um... She, I, th I think she's quite a bit older than me, but I don't really give a shit. She's fucking hot. That was actually really, really fun. Uh, I might do some more quizzes and stuff like this. I'm really happy with my result, Olivia Wilde. Uh, let me know what sort of answers you would have chose. Would you chop and change stuff? Um, you know, we've all got different preferences in people. Um, yeah, I might find some more quizzes to do this and uh, upload them because it was quite good fun. And Olivia Wilde, my new wife, apparently so. Uh, anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Um, and as always, stay safe, take care, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.